and welcome to my channel today uh, I'm not going to talk about plants or show any plants um, it will all be my about my top reasons for not making YouTube videos often I think when I'm about to repot the plant or uh, I bought some new plants uh, and I think uh, maybe I should do a YouTube video about that and then there's all these reasons uh, popping up in my head uh, why I am not making that with video so the first one is probably my looks I'm 41 years old and I probably look a little older I'm usually not very conscious about my appearance and so but um, when filming you have to first I watch myself talk on the video and then I watch the same thing over and over again while editing it so I need I uh, should get used to how, how I look and how I present myself um, yeah I guess uh, the whole thing about starting a YouTube video was originally kind of or well, one one of the reasons was therapeutic because uh, I think I need to work with my well body image and everyone else making YouTube videos seems to be young and perfect and or really old and very no knowledgeable and I'm kind of in the middle I guess um, the second one is I don't have a space to film because everything here in my apartment is a mess kind of like me uh, we match kind of um, <laughs> so so I don't have these nice clean surfaces just waiting to be filmed um, and um, usually that doesn't bother me at all uh, I, uh, it, I think it's completely okay to live in a mess basically um, it it require, requires too much effort to clean and uh, tidy up and so forth um, uh, everything will be back to the same in no time anyway uh, so it feels um, wasted unless you're making a YouTube video of course uh, so <laughs> So maybe if I get like thousands of subscribers or something then I might do a little more effort uh, just because of a video but at the moment mm, I don't think so it's not realistic um, you know, one thing I often uh, when I think about making a YouTube video I think uh, I tell myself well I'll clean that space tomorrow and make a video then but then I don't clean that space tomorrow and the video is never made so that's the second first one I'm a mess second one my apartment's a mess and the third reason main reason uh, is language because my English skills are kind of a mess too. Um, generally Norwegians are quite good at English. We have uh, strange pronunciations of things. Um, um, but if you come to Norway as a tourist and uh, you only speak English, that is usually not a problem. Um, really old folks they old people they some of the really old ones they didn't have english in school they only had german 
uh, even after the war. Um, but um, but most people uh, can understand what you're saying in English, and they may not be very uh, uh, used to formulating English sentences in their heads, like me, mm. and, and it shows. But uh, but somehow you will. The next person is probably a lot better in English. So, yeah. Um, I thought about making these videos in Norwegian, uh, but um, but I know this is a niche. It's a small niche. Uh, even well, house plants seems to be kind of a broad field, but. Uh, I don't think my videos would appeal to most people doing house plants, uh, more to the ones like me, kind of, always looking for something to experiment with, with or new cool plants they haven't seen before, or um, uh, a little curious on bonsai and how to get started, uh, things like that. And then to shrink the potential audience to just Norwegian speaking people would be, I'm guessing, maybe my videos would be interesting for like 200 people worldwide, something like that. And maybe, yeah, six Norwegians. Um, <laughs> if, uh, the video was in Norwegian so <laughs> yeah um, I don't have an have ambitions to make living out of this um, yeah I just want to have fun and maybe yeah I do want to share both my the knowledge knowledge I have but also the joy of plants and living things and my experiments the reception among my friends are more like mm -hmm. okay what's next uh, so <laughs> i really and i'm just look at this look at this it's working it's working i made it work uh, you see uh, so <laughs> so i need i need an audience maybe not the world's largest audience but but an audience who can, uh, can understand what I'm talking about and why I'm so excited. The last reason is more about the videos that uh, I do the filming and then usually some technical difficulty ends up ruining it or I realized the, the recording is really crappy 